Hello, this is Jerry Webb, the pastor of Hillsdale United Methodist Church, uh, reaching out to our community, our friends and members here at Hillsdale. Uh, a number of you have asked me what our response uh, to the devastation in Western North Carolina is, is looking like. How are we going to organize ourselves to help uh, the people in those 11 counties of our state that have just um, faced catastrophic uh, circumstances. So I wanted to tell you what our um, connection or church is doing as a United Methodist Church and what we're doing in response as well. Our leadership team met last night and we are taking $5,000 from our um, mission fund and sending it immediately to our conference um, resource center where they are equipped to help people uh, in their critical need uh, throughout the churches in Western North Carolina. We have a number of churches in Boone and Asheville and Watauga County and um, just all of those 11 areas that have been devastated. We have churches sprinkled throughout that area. So um, we're, we wanted financial assistance um, to go first and foremost, we want to pray for for those communities, but then they needed uh, money right away. Our um, conference, as well, has pledged two million dollars to that uh, whole devastated area of finances as well. Uh, that's over and beyond what churches can do, uh, what we did with the five thousand. But then, what can we do um, to help? Um, put resources, uh, material resources, in the hands of folks who have felt su such devastation too. So we're going to start collecting immediately uh, three things, bottled water, and specifically we're looking for gallon jugs of water. Um, there's a lot of uh, small bottled, bottled water that's already being sent to that area, but if you can secure gallon jugs of water, drinking water, large uh, containers like Le Bleu, for instance, would have, uh, we're going to put that together. Uh, we're asking you to start bringing those water items, putting them on the stage of the church where we can be praying for them. We're also going to be collecting diapers, uh, packages of diapers, any size is okay. Uh, those two things we're going to ask you to bring as you can to the church and we'll just line it up on the stage until we fill that area up. The third thing we're going to do is we're going to once again um, put together flood buckets. Now we're calling those buckets cleaning buckets, but we, we know them as flood buckets. The best way for us to do that is to allow our staff here at Hillsdale to go buy the bulk material um, for putting the material in the buckets and then allow you to sponsor a bucket. Um, to put together a cleaning bucket, it basically takes $50. So we're asking you to sponsor a flood bucket as a member of our church and to bring those funds this Sunday or um, whenever you're able. Uh, and then we will collect those bulk items through our staff and through volunteers. We will come together as soon as we can, uh, possibly next week even, um, around October the 9th, uh, to assemble those buckets. Then we're going to take all of that um, raw material, water, diapers, flood buckets and take it to a central point, one of our churches locally that will take it and distribute it to other um, points of distribution in Western North Carolina. That's the fastest way that we can get this re get these resources in the hands of people in need. Um, there is a sense of urgency. So we are asking you to do what you can to bring diapers and water uh, to the church as quickly as you can. 
and um, also to uh, sponsor a flood bucket. Uh, that, that's the best way that we can respond, along with our monetary gift that we're taking out of our mission fund to help the people of Western North Carolina. Uh, we will do all we can as quickly as we can, and, and it is our hope and prayer that these resources will reach the people who are in most need right away. Thank you for asking me about what we're going to do. Thank you for praying for the people of Western North Carolina, and thank you for your help. Uh, if you bring items like diapers or water, um, and there's nobody here at the church, just put those items in our prayer room that remains open all the time, and we'll move those items to the stage so that we can be praying over, over them this Sunday. And again, if possible, sponsor a cleaning bucket for $50. Um, sponsor as many as you can, and then we will put those together as soon as possible to get them in to Western North Carolina. Thank you for all that you do as people of faith and practice and in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Thank you.